Hey, I'm Russ. I'm out at my uh, bug out location greenhouse. I wanted to show you an idea I had. This is uh, heat tape. It's uh, 550 watts of heat tape is what it's rated for. And I have a situation, I'm just kind of curious how to solve the question of, of how do you keep your pipes from freezing in a home that you're not going to be at without purging the line with air. Um, so the solution I came up with that I was experimenting with is, can I plug in heat tape rated for 120 volts AC into a DC application? So I went ahead and, and I installed this receptacle that's fed via a couple panels hooked up in series. It's uh, 90 volts, uh, 900 watts total. It's about 10 amps. And the question is, Will this work? Will I have any problems running it? Now, obviously, if the sun's not out, you're not going to get current. But what I found was, you know, I've hooked this up a few days ago and just to find out its longevity and make sure there's nothing strange happening running DC on an AC uh, heat tape. And I haven't had any issues. Uh, so um, it's actually worked remarkably well. And it validates a proof of concept that if you have a situation where you may not have a standard grid uh, sourced receptacle, they can hook up a couple panels to uh, either, you know, maybe you have some uh, ice dams uh, or you have, in my case, pipes you want to keep thawed through the winter. This will supply you enough energy to do that. Uh, it's pretty easy to hook up a couple panels. And at 25 cents a watt, which is what I paid for the two panels I hooked up, plus another $100 for the, your uh, mounting hardware. Uh, you know, you're 350 bucks for your power supply, and this was 50 bucks for my heat tape. So it really is a, you know, I wouldn't say a cheap solution, but reasonably inexpensive comparatively to make sure your pipes on your structure don't freeze. So I just wanted to share that to you. Um, I validated it. It seems to work. Uh, it might be something worth considering. Hey, thanks. Have a good one.